we are back with Eldar Highborn. We just got our butts kicked. Uh, we got pushed out of this mine. Uh, he probably feels humiliated. I mean, look at him. He's not supposed to lose. But, uh, oh, how the mighty have fallen. If this was a movie, I'd be happy about this. But not in this case. We are, we are the bad guy. So we don't want to die. So we're going to get back in there. Show them who's boss. I hope you guys are doing good today. I am doing well. I am excited to grow. I saw that guy down in there and I was a little confused. Um, I'm excited to grow this character. If anything, too, I'm ready to explore and do a deep dive on the triumphant warlock spells they seem really interesting and uh, this Eldar character is a lot of fun and doing these permadeath series I don't really have to have a real focus on uh, writing a or following a story you, know, you can kind of do whatever he wants Alright, let's get there. Dude, I hate that those little dudes retreat like that. It drives me crazy. Ooh, we got fillets. Alright, we're not done yet. Jeez pop out of nowhere like that. Okay. Where is he? Oh, how'd you get down there? Jump! Jump around! Jump around! Wow, he has a lot of health. So we're gonna wanna. Well, what is he doing? Awesome. Great, that's great. <laughs> All right, let's explore what we need to explore in here. Loot. And uh, I just need to level up. Requires a key. What is that? I have no idea what that is. Definitely curious. Never seen that there before. So that's when you play you play Skyrim modded. Sometimes you don't read the the read me and you start playing with it, the mod. And then you're confused why there's a random um, chest. But maybe it's not random. Maybe it's always been there. I just never noticed. Could that be? Yeah. That, that, that's a total possibility. But for me to miss it. And uh, this mine. I mean, come on. I'm better than that. You're better than that, Icarus. Maybe I'm not. Alright, I'm going to highlight one of those torches. I kind of like using torch. Um, I like using a torch as a player. Normally, Eldar would be having somebody else hold the torch for him. His magic that he is specialized in is so focused on uh, his warlock spells that um, he's never learned candlelight or other spells that uh, mages would study and focus on. So we're going to study some of our spells. We're going to study the Balefire spell. The animation isn't clicking in, but he's learning. So four hours have passed. 
All right. I, I like this studying spell because it does punish you a little bit if you're wearing if wearing if you're running survival mods. Um, you'll get hungry and tired. There is no free lunch. I'm tempted to just spend the day studying spells, but I won't. I won't get back out there. Let's say a prayer to Trinimac. Big dog. All right. So we're growing with uh, favor with our patron god. Whatever we're doing, he's appreciating it. I, I legitimately think the thing that is boosting our favor is we're killing humans. Um, tr I don't know much. Oh, sorry, man. I don't know much about Trinimac. I think I've researched him before. I know he's an elven deity that might be connected to Lorcan. If anybody wants to discuss this in the comments, feel free to. Oh, you know, I do think I know who Trinimac is. He's kind of a paladin knight figure. And I think that he was killed by Boethia. And then, oh, okay, now it's coming back to me. She ate him. Or he, she, right? I, whatever. Boethia ate Trinimac and then pooped him out. Pooped him. And uh, he became Malakath. Double check that. But I think that's the lore on Trinimac. And then Malakath. What do we got going on here? Nothing? Oh gosh. Alright. I really like this weekend spell. Oh, we get hit with one of those flame spells and we are dead. I can't even say that we're a glass cannon because it's not like I do that much damage. We good? If we saved anyone, it wasn't on purpose. The only bacon we care about saving is our own. Okay. Uh, we will go to the city. But if it gets too dicey, we'll move out. I, I, I just, I don't feel comfortable trying to break into a city that's being overwhelmed by zombies in a permadeath series. I will die. We will die. I will die. Okay? And then no more Eldar. I won't want to play him anymore. I guess we could restart the series, but um, it's just not fun. So we have to be very careful. So there was a group of Draugr, some zombies moving through here. No? Good? Oh my gosh! more? Alright, don't get cocky, Eldar. <sighs> I'm just having flashbacks of, uh, what was the other character's name? I know it started with an M. I got to play him once, so it's not like I memorized his name. But he died right at the entrance to that area. Are we getting close to leveling up at least for destruction? Yes, we are. Okay. Yeah, you guys see that? Look alive. Alright, save. Why do I save? Just in case I hit someone I don't want to. I don't want to collect the bounty. 
I've said this a million times, but things get real wonky when uh, you hit people who didn't mean to. Ooh. Okay, gotta be careful. There's some over there. I always need to remember, have the gremlin out. It's one way I can fight without fighting. Ooh. Gosh, more. Um, watch out. This could go very bad very quickly. Okay, let's check out the Kaji. Are they good? normally refrain from summoning that gremlin in this area but ooh, I need to throw that on but uh means the apocalypse they know they might know that I'm a bad guy but I'm their bad guy right now oh <laughs> I thought the gremlin was gonna eat me I'm jumpy okay yeah, okay, see, I think it dropped down a little bit, the bail fire, because I leveled up. Okay, I hear people fighting. Oh! Okay, let's help them. Let's do what we can. I'm not going to... We're going to take the high ground. I wonder if that's a real actual strategy. Take, take the high ground when you're fighting. I just know that from Star Wars. Okay. Alright, should I... Um... I'll just say this. Yeah, no joke. I'll just say this is not a good sign. That we had to do all this fighting to get here. I'm just going to turn right around if um, if I hear any thooms or fighting. If there's a ruckus in here, I'm walking out. I'm leaving. Yeah, look. You get to the cloud district very often. We'll pay whatever it takes, but we must have <sighs> Let me think, let me think, let me think, let me think. Should we even try? I mean, we should try to hold the city, right? It's just going to get harder. There's death lords. Is there any way that they can thin those out? I'll take the job, don't expect a miracle. Okay, here's what we can do. I'm willing to try this. Send our little buddy. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of them. Are you fighting them? Are you even trying? Oh! Jeez, that could have been us. See? No. Watch out! I'm gone. I'm gone. Stay for a second. See how they do. But no, look at look at that. I is my settings set to low? Because they are shouting often. Is there setting in Ragnarok 
for how often they shout. Speed rate. How quickly the drug are spread. Duration. Accuracy. Allows Draugr to target important NPCs. Okay. Maybe then it's just immersive. Sorry guys, I just want to make sure. It's just ridiculous how powerful those thum that Thum is. Yeah, I have it down on low. I'd almost prefer that they just didn't shout. I mean, it makes for really interesting gameplay. Okay, I think they're coming for us. We just gotta go. Uh, I don't know what the next plan of attack is. To live to- Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. Did that kill her? Is she dead? Oh my gosh. Watch out! Where's the gremlin? Go! Maybe they'll come out. If they come out. Come on. Um. That the town is overwhelmed. Overwhelmed. White Run has fallen. We have to go. To where I I don't know. Maybe we can. I I think the best thing that we can do is level up, get stronger. Um. And by just following that process, we can actually overtake a town. Take it back and start pushing back. Are you kidding me? Come on. Be gone. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, I was going to say I should try to pull leather from them, but... I think what we're gonna do is try to take this camp. See how that goes. Anybody I can just practice on my spells on, I'm going to. Little foxes, chickens. Um, Cause it is all about surviving delish um just need a bedroll now i think we've leveled up a couple times so all right hello my friend Nice to meet you. Do you want a piece? Because we want one. Oof. Eldar. In the back. I mean, come on. He is that guy. Cutthroat, he's dirty. Alright. Got someone coming.
Man, am, why am I doing so much damage? I think it's just a really powerful sword. Man, I'm not even wearing... Maybe it was a good idea to try to take this fort. Okay, we won't. Did you guys see that? Eldar's losing his mind. You just saw an elk get lobbed up in the air and then fall to its death. Let's go. Watch out. Oh, I need to be so aware of my surroundings. One little slip and I can die. Oh. Okay. Go, 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 go. That's not how I wanted to play that out. I mean, I want to be a little bit more tactical. So he's in heavy armor. It's like every step that this oof, this big oof takes, making all this noise clinking around, his cape's all flapping in the wind. That was, that was truly scary though. I could have died. Um, okay, let's just wait for our health. Go back up. Here's something we can do. Study our spell. It's just a little glitch. The camera gets weird. Hmm, interesting. Good read. Okay. Uh, I need to be so patient. I, I can't just, like, wade in there and get over it get over my head on this but my like instinct as a player is not to take my time like I that was even probably too quick okay we have a more tactical approach Light him up. Oh my gosh. Frickin' frick frick. You guys ever get killed trying to exit? Oh my gosh! He followed us. Very careful that we don't wake up the hornet's nest up there. It's good though. Do you submit? I, I hate that this character kind of has to run and bend the knee to all these. Um, did you fall? Why did he fall? Did you guys see that? He like tripped. He used to bend the knee to all these bandits. But Eldar, that's what you get for whatever you did in Somerset. You ticked off the wrong people, man. Alright. We're going to study this for two hours. While we're waiting to heal up. Cool effect is when he's damaged. You see he's kind of holding his side. I just feel like that's a really cool addition you know, makes it. You can see the toll that getting damaged took on him. Okay, we're gonna have to find whoever else is in here. Okay, I can't just summon either because the summon will get stuck behind me. Yeah, what was that? Okay. This gremlin feels useless, by the way. I mean, he doesn't do anything.
Oh! is going on here, like, fight. down all right oh hate you you know there's one more guy down there but <sighs> okay we're gonna take health Never take stamina. Um, so I'm gonna take take heavy armor. I'm gonna start getting experience that way. And then one of our primary attacks, because our gremlin does absolutely nothing, is gonna be in destruction. So let me make sure that I get a little bump. This is one of our longest episodes for this character. It's because I'm neurotic playing this. <laughs> it's just intense. All right, so it's 21. Let's see if it brings it up at all. Yeah, it did, it bring it up to 22. Let's kill that last guy. And I think we'll call it an episode. Did you find me? All right. We die from this dude. And that would have just been really embarrassing. That's how you know dire these permadeath series are. Uh, there's a permadeath series that I watch on Saturdays. It's a lot of fun. I can't remember the youtuber's name it's really good he's playing a bard uh dumb a dunmer bard oh i can't remember his name great great content though on his channel um this help, does not help him out at all for me not to know his name uh i'll look that up though in the next episode and let you guys know all right well, I'm just going to be doing some looting over here. Uh, but Eldar, thanks you for watching. And we will see you in the next episode.